What's going on everybody? My name is Alex Friedman and in today's video we're going to be looking at free courses and resources for data analysts. Now when I was first starting out I was flat broke and I could not even afford to take a course and so when I was starting out I just tried everything free that I could find and through that I have found a lot of really good resources that I think you guys will enjoy. Links to all the websites that we look at today will be in the description so be sure to go check those out. The first course that we're going to be looking at today is from Khan Academy and that's on SQL querying and managing data. I think this course was absolutely amazing, it is completely free and Khan Academy does an amazing job at actually walking through SQL and what you need to know. As you can see over here they go through the SQL basics but they go through a lot more than just the basics in this course and remember all of this is completely free. Every lesson is accompanied with a video that you can find on YouTube and then you can actually practice what they're actually teaching you in this area right up here and then you can actually run the queries and practice them. And then they'll have challenges like this one where they'll actually ask you to solve a problem and you have to write out the script or the query to solve it. The next website that we're going to be looking at is through WeSchools, at least I think that's how it's pronounced. This website gives definitions on the topic that you're trying to learn and then gives you a lot of examples on that topic. And then there's a try it now feature where you actually click on it and you can run the script yourself or change it if you'd like to and you can actually run it and get results right down here. The next one is a YouTube video and this one is actually really good for people who know nothing about SQL. It takes you through the absolute basics of what is SQL, what is a database, what is data. It takes you all the way through to where you know things like subqueries and joins and I think this is a really really good video as an intro or an introduction to SQL as a whole. And if you want to learn MySQL specifically, Program with Mosh does an absolutely amazing job of taking you through the very, very basics just like the last video, all the way up to maybe intermediate. And a little self-plug here, if you are like me where you actually want to download the database and insert your own data and mess around like that, I highly recommend downloading SQL Server Management Studio. It is completely free to download and I have a full tutorial on how to do that. And then I have a basics and intermediate course as well for SQL if you want to check that out. Now on to resources for Python. For Python this video for me was the holy grail of learning everything from scratch and I feel like I know Chuck himself personally because I've watched this video so many times and learned so much from it. He takes you all the way through the basics to some really advanced stuff and really explains it extremely well. I think he's a college professor somewhere and so he has a really good way to deliver the information in a very understandable way. So I highly recommend checking out freecodecamp.org's video on Python for Everybody by Dr. Chuck. Absolutely amazing. Here's another YouTube video by CS Dojo. If you want to use Python for data visualizations and you want to learn pandas, this video was absolutely critical in me actually learning and knowing how to use the basics and then I worked up from there. And so if you are just starting out and really want to learn those things, this video is the absolute first place that I would start. The next website that I'm going to recommend is learnpython.org. It is absolutely phenomenal and it takes you through everything in a very detailed way. In this website you can learn everything from the absolute basics to data science tutorials where you're using NumPy and pandas, all the way down to the advanced stuff where you're using generators and regular expression and things that you may never actually need to know but it's all here in case you really want to take your Python to the next level. If you're wanting to download an actual Python IDE I highly recommend using Visual Studio Code. I love it and I use it all the time even at work. And so this video is going to take you through how to actually download and install it on your computer and trust me it can be quite a complicated process and so something like this where it's a video and takes you step by step is really really important and it gets you really good hands-on experience with something that you might use in a work environment in the future. Next we're going to be looking at Tableau and I chose Tableau because I think it is the most widely used data visualization tool there is and I also think it's the most user-friendly and easy to download and use for free and so Tableau.com does a really good job of actually teaching you the basics and everything you need to know and although there is a paid version you can use all their free training videos and it is hours upon hours of really really good videos and information on how to actually use Tableau and get good visualizations. Next is a YouTube video to actually take you through how to use Tableau and get those visualizations. Again I really like videos and so videos help me walk through those things. Unfortunately, I could not find the actual video that I used way long ago, but I found this video and watched the entire thing through just to make sure that it was a good video for you guys. So be sure to check out this video if you want to learn Tableau. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope these courses and resources really help. I know they helped me a ton when I was first starting out and really took me to a really good place where I felt like I could start applying to jobs. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe below and I'll see you in the next video.